All right. It's keyboard time. So Jeremy starts us off with the DOS keyboard, mechanical keyboards. He says, I love the clicky real keys on this so much so that I bought the Windows version for my desk at work if I ever go back there. And they have all kinds of options uh, there. If you go to DOS, D-A-S keyboard dot com, they started about. Uh, I think you started about 120 bucks and go up from there. So, yeah. Well, Scott has some things for us. Uh, talking about keyboards, I have the Logitech MX Keys and MX Ergo. Uh, MX Keys being a keyboard and MX Ergo being uh, a trackball. I originally purchased them because it allows me to instantly change which computer they worked on by hitting a key or moving the mouse between screens. Um, and there's also the one that I have, and let, let me let me post the link to it. So I have the um, Logitech Solar Keyboards. But Logitech says that your Solar Keyboard, with the K750, is no longer available. Yeah, but I'm looking at a page on... Uh... On Amazon, and, and it is. <laughs> okay, so they've got some overstock or whatever. All right, well, yeah, if you want one of those, get it quick, because it doesn't look like it's going to last. Uh, it, listener John uh, also sings the praises of that Logitech MX keys uh, keyboard. Mm -hmm. I love this thing. The backlit keys and that wonderful key feedback are just a few things that I love the most about it. All right, and then listener Tim brings us to an open source keyboard. He says, uh, you should check out the launch keyboard by System76. It's a mechanical keyboard made in Denver, Colorado. The hardware and software are open source and the keyboard works with Mac OS, Linux, and Win Windows. It's at system76.com. And of course, we put a link in the show notes for you. I like it. No conversation about keyboards for the Mac would be complete, I think, without at least a brief mention of the keyboards that Matthias has been making for years, but they have lots of them now. They've got an Ergo Pro keyboard. They have a Dvorak layout keyboard. That's pretty cool. 